Hey guys, I've come across this uh, cool series of science books, magazine sort of things in uh, in Japan called Otona no Kagaku. That's what it says there in Japanese. It means uh, science for adults. It's produced by Gak and Mook, a company over here in Japan. And there are a series of kits which you get a magazine and um, each one is a different theme and it goes through the science of what this kit is about. So uh, some of the early ones are a bit harder to get, but I might start trying to go through numerical order. We've got zero, 01 here and we'll go 2, 3, 4 whichever ones I can find because what happens is they uh, they release these for a certain amount of time and then after a while they just don't make them anymore and move on to the new the new numbers and new models so this is number one I managed to track down and it's actually one of those little putt putt boats where you put the candle under the little boiler and it putt 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 and moves along in the water so we got the uh, the main book it's, it's pretty thick because it's got a kit inside and then the magazine stuck to the back and uh, you can see there, there's a little boiler and a few little windows showing a little peek of what's inside. Then on the other side, it's kind of like the back of the book, but we've got a magazine, which is, looks like there's a bit of a uh, anime there, or manga, and it's um, talking about some uh, discovery of the, the sciences and different bits and pieces. I, I can't really read much of it, but <laughs> we'll flick through and see what we can find. Uh, some of the newer ones that actually come with a uh, English manual. You can download an English PDF. Because they've so, sort of started to become popular outside Japan, but the earlier ones are only in Japanese. But it's very pictorial, so we can work our way through. Now, it looks like there's a lot of general science stuff in here. Maybe uh, loosely, loosely related to what the project is, what the kit is. But, um, yeah, it looks like, like how to make a kaleidoscope rings on like a chain and sort of stuff all these little cool science things and it looks like there's some more products you can purchase here there's like a rock tumbler there and there's a, a a valve amplifier and little planetarium clock sort of thing some phonographs of different designs but the one we're interested in is right at the start and it is the putt putt boat so that's the one we're going to make there it's like a trimaran sort of design, pretty cool idea. But um, you're probably more familiar with this style, the little tin boat. You put the candle underneath inside there, and then they just like make that sort of characteristic putting sound as they, they move around inside your bowl of water. I remember my brother had one of these when he was younger. It was pretty cool. He used to like playing with it. But um, yeah, I'll um, open up this, this kit, and then we'll uh, see what we got and start putting the thing together. Let's get to it. All right, so to get inside, I think we're just going to have to slice a bit of tape. And there we are. Not much to it. pull all the bits out it's kind of like a soft sort of plastic looks like they're blow molded or something and we've got an injection molded top cover main body there's our boiler this is what does all the action so what we do is we put a, a flame underneath here that's kind of like a brass sort of bit of metal there, like a little film, and that pops up and down and then sucks the water in and pushes it out. Then we've got a, oh, a few tiny little candles, all like birthday candles, which um, cut down in length. So we could probably use normal birthday candles when we run out of those ones. And that looks like the, uh, the flame shield and a candle holder there. So... I'll get the instructions and uh, maybe we'll go to a time lapse while I put this thing together. And here's a completed boat. So we've got the uh, the candle under the back, 
and that's it there in the little holder looks like a like I said like a uh, birthday candle that's been cut down in size so it'll be easy to find replacements we've got our uh, boiler here with the the brass kind of cover brass top there which pops in and out the two pipes come down and then out the back and that sucks in the water and blows it out as it heats up and cools down the firebox which just stops the heat from uh, melting the plastic the black is um, of course the main structure of the boat and then we got the three pontoons which allow us to uh, to steer it wherever we want it to go around in circles or whatever so I'll, um, I'll adjust the camera I'll show you some diagrams and explain how this thing works and then we'll uh, we'll stick it in the bath and see how it actually performs in real life okay so I've got a nice big picture here showing you how it works basically we've got the boiler up the top with the flame just here and I've got the pipes coming down and out the back so basically along the bottom here we got the uh, picture so you got the number one the flames heating up the water you get a bit of steam steam keeps building up you can see it's starting to bulge over the top there then it pops out and uh, with the pressure and the pressure kind of pushes out the pipes then uh, it all cools down the uh, pressure drops and uh, sucks the new water in and then as the water comes in the diaphragm pops in and then it repeats so it's just popping in and out and sucking water in and blowing it out and that creates a net forward thrust so let's head over to the bathroom and uh, see how it actually works all right so we're in the bathroom sorry about the bad lighting it's pretty dimming here but I've got the boat set up to go kind of around in circles now what we have to do is we've got to use this syringe thingy you can see against my arm I've got to squirt some water into one of these pipes so it comes out the other side so I'll take some water and there we go and we stick it in the bathtub and then I will light the candle and give it a second and that should start popping away a bit of candle dust there There we go. Look at that, that's working pretty good. So how cool was that? I was pretty impressed. I thought it was pretty cool actually. So that's uh, issue one of the Otona no Kagaku. Otona no Kagaku. Uh, the putt putt boat. So I think I'll definitely be uh, getting a few more of these. Alright, so if you like that, let us know. Don't forget, we got the Patreon. And as always, just keep watching. We'll see you next time.